Welcome to another Keyshot Quick Tip. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to set a custom startup scene in Keyshot 7 so that you can work more efficiently by reusing existing cameras, environments, studios, and more. So let's imagine I'm a housewares designer that works on smaller handheld products like this water kettle. I've set up this scene with my desired aspect ratio, a few cameras, a couple environments, and studios to link them all together. These are all my standard views that I'm required to produce for each product, but there's no need to recreate them for each new scene I work on. Instead, I'm going to clear geometry from the edit menu and save this as an empty scene to my Keyshot 7 resources folder. I'll save it as custom startup dot bit, but you can name it whatever you want. I'll then go to edit preferences and point to it from the default startup scene entry. I'll save changes and close Keyshot. Now, each time I start up Keyshot, it has my desired aspect ratio, my cameras, environments, and studios ready to go. I just have to import my new model, and to be even more efficient, I'll enable Assign Materials from Library in the Import dialog. This will automatically assign library materials with the same name as the appearances I've assigned in CAD. Now I can go to the queue, click the Add Studios button, and populate the queue with all the views I need, saving me time and the tedious task of setting them up manually all over again. Setting a custom startup scene and assign materials from library are features available to all users of Keyshot 7, but keep in mind that Studios and the queue are pro-only features. Thanks for watching this Keyshot quick tip. For more Keyshot learning content, click on one of the playlists below. To make sure you don't miss any new content as it's posted, subscribe to our channel by clicking the Keyshot icon in the center of the screen.